Pinagkaguluhan sa Twitter, Facebook, TikTok, at iba pang social media platforms ang video ni dating senador at ngayoy presidential aspirant Bongbong Marcos kasama si incumbent governor at congressional candidate Joe Zabiri, dahil umano sa pag-iwas ni BBM ng kanyang kamay kay Governor Joe Zabiri para sana itaas sa kanilang uniteam rally sa bukid noon. Matutunghayan ang naturang video matapos lamang ang munting intro. Makikitang kukunin sana ni Governor Zabiri ang kamay ni BBM upang ito'y itaas ngunit ito'y kanyang inilayo. Samot sariya ang naging reaksyon ng mga netizens sa bidyong ito. Nakakatawang nakakaawa. So yung gusto mong maging presidente focus lang sa sarili niya, wala siyang pake sa'yo. May dahilan po yan, but ayaw niya magpahawak ng kamay kasi for the respect of other candidates sa bawat partido. Ang bastos ng ugali, not deserving to be in any position in the government, hashtag never again, hashtag never again to Marcos. Hindi po siya pwede magtaas ng kamay ng local candidates to avoid misunderstanding between other local candidates na sumusuporta din sa kanya. Sa isang Facebook post idinaan ni senatorial aspirant Migs Zabiri ang kanyang paliwanag tungkol sa naganap na issue. The issue on the alleged failure of BBM to raise the hand of my father, incumbent governor and congressional candidate Joe Zabiri, During our joint grand rally in Malaybalay, Bukidnon, on the 31st of March 2022 is part of an adversarial spin, the intention of which is to sow disunity within the Uniteam and our local political party. The truth is it's just a simple miscommunication between my father and BBM on the sequence of events, which is that, after BBM speaks, He was supposed to wave the flag and then raise the hand of the local parties, which he did. After he waved the flag, obviously there is a malicious intent to create intrigue by only showing that particular portion of the video and omitting totally the second portion of that sequence of events. For us in Bukidnon, it's not an issue at all, and as a matter of fact we are still in disbelief at the amount of people who turned up for that grand rally, Close to 100,000 people came to listen to the Uniteam candidates, I believe that should be highlighted and not every little thing that happens on stage, let's not make a big thing out of nothing peace everyone. 